Hi guys, my name is Sky, and today we're going to be talking about how to make YouTube banners with PicMonkey.com. If you are new to my channel, please go and hit and hit that wide red button down there and slap that like button so I can keep making more videos like this one. And please guys, help me make it to 40,000 subscribers so I can make it to the convention in California. So, let's start by going to YouTube, Creator Studio, View Channel. We're going to be replacing this banner that you can see in this area. So, let's go to Edit, Edit Channel Artwork, then click here on How to Create a Channel Art. Then scroll down to Image Guidance for Channel Art, and click on Channel Art Templates. The template will download to your computer as a zip file. Uncompress the file. We have two files, the one for PicMonkey and another for Photoshop. So, let's go to PicMonkey. I totally love PicMonkey as it lets me be very creative. So, let's bring the image in here to edit. This template is giving us the guidance for different platforms. For TV, desktop, tablets, and the mobile ones, which is the one we're going to be working on. Let's go to Overlay, Geometrics, and select the square and mark the mobile part which I mentioned we are going to be working with. Then select transparent. So let's go to Google Images and find a nice background picture. I will look for something glittery that is big enough that I can use. This is perfect for me. So let's save and go back to PicMonkey and upload the picture as an overlay. Now, let's make the picture big enough to cover everything. This is the layer in the order they appear. I am moving the rectangle to the top again so that we can see it. So, let's go to text. I love the amazing amounts of text styles that PicMonkey has. I will use Camellia to write Sky Goes Live. We will center it to the size 175. Then I will write the second line that will be vlogs, inspirations, and educational stuff. I will change the font to Sacramento, then I will find the rectangle in the layers and delete it. That is just perfect. Now all I have to do is save it. As you can see, the size is way too big, so we're going to change from PNG to JPG. And the size will be smaller. So, let's hit save and go back to YouTube. And upload our amazing creation. This is how it will look on different devices. Here it is. I love it. 